Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again today for another Kickstarter critique where I take a look at a different Kickstarter project every single time and give my honest thoughts on how that Kickstarter is being ran. Once again, this is not a review of the product, but of the Kickstarter page itself. I know, if you enjoy that sort of weird thing, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below as I'm trying to reach 9,000 subscribers to celebrate my 9-year anniversary of making YouTube content. And also, consider supporting my Patreon down below as I'm currently a stay-at-home dad and every penny really does count. But, right now, I'm very excited to be checking out the most popular project in all of hardware Kickstarter that is the Deluxe Seeker Ergonomic Vertical Mouse with OLED Screen. Full spectrum, light vertical mouse with display screen and customizable, uh, presumable controls there. And wow, that is a really impressive looking mouse right there. It's already raised 585 Hong Kong uh, money, whatever currency that is. Fun in 10 minutes. So I'm looking at this. I'm, I'm loving this image right here, the neat Deluxe Seeker. This is nice, but fun in 10 minutes. No one cares. No one cares if you're fun in 10 minutes anymore. People have ruined that by having like $8 funding goals. You know what would be better up here? a price. The price of that mouse right there. I'm uh, What? $84. Just $84 right there. That'd be so beautiful. Because, as always, there's three things that a Kickstarter creator needs to answer, which is do I want it? Can you do it? How much is it? I need to be convinced that all three of those questions are good answers. So, as always, hopefully we'll get those answers in this video. Let's go! Mm, okay. Whoa. Yes. Like it. So it can work with or without it. Love it. What? What? Oh! Oh, stop it. Stop it. Oh. Oh, too long battery life? How long? What? That's where the blood is Beautiful. I will say that hardware, that, that, that did not look that impressive. I don't know if I'd show that. Like, it's good that you showed it. Man, yeah, I guess it is. I guess it is. I take that back. It's just, that was the, uh, that one image kind of just jarred me out of everything. Like, everything else is just looks so chic and techy and beautiful and amazing. And then there's like, uh, that looked like 1998, you know, MS-DOS type stuff there. Oof. Oh, hit him with the colors at the end. Leave him wanting more. Beautiful. Very well done video. Top-notch video. Kudos to the makers of that video. So, the do I want it is a resounding yes. Like, that was so sleek. That looks so nice. Can you do it? Still needs to be answered. How much is it? Still needs to be answered. Let's go. First created zero back. Always looks ugly. Always looks bad. It just looks like you're here for money. Uh, which you are, but you can always make yourself look like more of a member of the community. Go back 50 things for a dollar right now. Spend $50. And if you don't even want to spend the $50, go back 50 things for a dollar that are going to fail. And then it's going to say zero created, 50 back. And it's like, oh, Deluxe World. They support Kickstarter. I want to support them. It just, it just, it's easy marketing. And you can do it so, it's not marketing. It's just an easy way to convince backers i do believe founded in 1994 deluxe has over 27 years experience in the scientific and technological industry focused on the r d manufacturing sales and service experiments for ai products deluxe has been a long time until intel strategic partner and have exported products more than 120 20. uh i need a website oh no 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 oh it's a cake booster oh okay so uh that means there will be a link down below if you click on that link then uh, and if you back this because if it looks awesome which i don't know i'm not saying that yet uh i'll get a small portion of it because that's uh, what cake booster does so that's how they're promoting this project and then pick starter but that does mean that our customer service is something you need to pay close attention to because that means uh way zia Oh, I'm sorry if I mispronounced that, is the only person doing the updates in the comments right now. There's no collaborators helping in there. So, interesting. So, the so am I convinced? And the answer is no. Uh, deluxe. So, let's see. 19, let's try this. Deluxe. This is going to be so hard to find anything. Deluxe business checks. Trusted. Yeah. Oh, wait. 
no. Uh, maybe maybe in nineteen ninety four. Because I, I want to, I want to try and find something about them. Because once again, you didn't link me to anything. How are you not going to link me to anything? Like, oh, you do AI products? Why don't you show me some of what you did? Because that's an easy way to convince me of the can you do it. I just did one for a game called uh, Bar uh, Heroes of Barcadia. It's like this beer drinking uh, board game. And it was their first created. So, you know, how do you prove yourself? They linked me to a really nice website where I could already buy things. And I was already impressed by how they run their business. And you didn't do that. So now it's just like, oh, that's who you are? This could all be crap. You could have wrote, like, this could, like, I could have, I could write this. It's just, back it up. And hopefully you do on here, on in here. But right now, the can you do it, I'm not impressed. How much is it? I think it, I think, oh, hopefully they get right down to it. Because honestly, that video is so damn good. Meet Deluxe Seeker, world's first ergonomic vertical mouse with OLED screen. Uh, so this is a Kick Booster product. I'm going to make a bold prediction because for some, for whatever reason on all these Kick Booster products, if it's just so damn repetitive. They're going to regurgitate everything that was in that video with a couple extra little nuggets mixed in here and there. Let's see. Uh, lots of text. Three convenient ways to connect. You already did this. And yeah, they, they recycle everything from the video. Like that video, they know that video is amazing. So they pretty much just... Pick apart that video, then have someone completely write a whole bunch of stuff from that video. Multi-device connections with one key switch. Get more done with Deluxe Seeker Pro. Cool customizable mouse button and DPI control. Nifty Skippy. Why do you need an ergonomic mouse? Oh, because it hurts your hand. Blah, 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 blah. Just get me with the price. And this is what I hate. Like, this is doing really well right now. But I feel like it could be doing so much better if they just got down to it. Just hit me with the price. And think about it. If they hit me with the price in that main image, I already know how much it is. And then after I watch the video, the do I want it is answered. Dear God, yeah, I want that mouse. And then maybe people just kind of gloss over the can you do it and they immediately back, which I think is what you should be trying to do, Kick Booster, or the people running this. You don't want people to look into your track record. You don't want people to type in Deluxe and not be able to find anything. You just want to show me that amazing Minute 20 video, have me open my wallet, and get me out the front door. Just get better at it, I think. A uh, stylish mouse to highlight your desktop. And if you're a newer watcher of this, me and Cake Booster have a long track record. I've checked out a lot of Cake Booster products, and uh, they're very, they're very hit or miss. Let me tell you, coloring up your life. But these look, oh man, this looks so hot. Those look so hot. Hey, you know what? Sixty nine dollars, and that's available. Is that is that available right now? Uh, and then it goes up to seventy nine dollars. So what? So it's going to be sixty nine, eighty. So what's the what's the actual price? What is just the regular damn price? First, you, what's the price? What, so what's, what is going to be the price here? No, I mean, like, what's the actual Kickstarter price? Because all you're showing me is super early birds. Is this just going to be one where you're just going to keep doing early birds and then slowly raising the price? Which, you know, is actually not a terrible idea. So it's $159. I think it's regularly going to be $159. Then why does this one go... So $79 or $179. What? 135 to 38. Oh, this is so if you get two, that one I actually understand. So the price is going to be $79. Is it going to be 80? So what, whatever the price is, let's just say it's $89, but secretly everyone's going to get the super early bird. Let's, let's go by that. Let's say that you are going to say that there is, in fact, a pledge level that is $89 and no one's going to take it because you're just going to keep opening up more and more early birds. That's fine with me. You take that $89 price point, you slap it up there on the top left, I get wowed by your video, and then I find out, whoa, I can actually get it for $69 right now because I'm an early bird backer? Holy crap, I'm in! And I'm not looking into who Deluxe is. I'm not looking at anything else. I'm immediately saying, whoa, good value, good value, awesome video, I'm sold. But you're not running the Kickstarter that way, and I feel like that is a huge misstep, Kick Booster. Because I'm assuming I, I do believe Kick Booster has to run these because they are so insanely similar every single time I see them. Uh, so let's compare. What are we comparing? These are, wait, are these dec wait. There's different ones. What? Wait, 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 wait. There's different ones. This is the Pro One. This is the Basic Two. Wait, what? Basic One, Pro One. Oh, oh. 
and the and they're what they're twenty dollars difference. So the suit, so the pro one is one hundred seventy nine dollars, and the basic one is one hundred fifty nine dollars. Okay, and now you showed me all these. You know what? I don't need to see these. I don't need to see these. Hey, just rub it in your face. You weren't early enough. You weren't early enough. You weren't early enough. You weren't early enough. You're never gonna be as good as your brother. Just keep scrolling. You know, it's like, come on, why should you just get rid of these? I, I was trying, I'm trying to navigate your damn page. You just smeared in my face that I wasn't here in time. Uh, all right, so, basic pro. What's the difference? Weight, slightly different. Maximum device control through these customizable buttons. But what are these? What the hell are these things? Are these competitors? You don't even tell me their names. Like, you're just like, oh, here's one of our competitors and what it does. Okay, I do like this shot, though, but it's just, like, mention it. Mention their names right there so I can go read through the research. Like, if you're going to name and shame, like, right now you're just shaming and you're not naming. I'm a name and shamer. You got to do both. You can't just name the name or shame the shame. You got to name and shame. And right now, you're not naming, and it, it makes it look way less impressive because, once again, it could just be just making stuff up. You're almost making me curse in my video. Knock it off, kick booster. Like, ugh. All right, so we got different colors. So what is the difference? Oh, oh, the the display is nicer. Oh, wait, there's one that doesn't have the screen display. What? Who's getting that? Isn't the whole appeal of the damn thing that it has a screen on it? Like, isn't that? Ergonomic with uh, that's like you pounding your chest. We've got an OLED screen, but like, oh, you can get one without the OLED screen if you don't want that. <laughs> like, okay, okay, I'm very interested to see. Uh, and so now, by doing this, you've just made things less clear, at least in my personal opinion. But let's go over here. Hopefully, the pledge levels are well organized. So we have the Super Early Bird Deluxe Seeker Basic One. So this is the crap one that I don't think most people are gonna want. Because why would you want it when you could pay an extra 20 bucks and get a screen? Okay, I don't know. So $69. $69 does have the shipping listed here. I do love that. But once again, is it converted? Uh, is it converted? Yeah, so I think it converts. Okay, so it tells me the shipping in there. So the shipping section, wherever it is, is all always inexcusable because that's always nice. I, I wish more board game companies would do this. All right, so this is the pro one. This is what everyone's going to want. Super Early Bird Deluxe, 81 left of 200. Now, what's sold out? So, the basic one sold out. And that's going to be so... I wonder how many people... How many people are going to be so mad that this doesn't have a damn display? Because they didn't read it. <laughs> because it's not clearly labeled. Uh, okay. I don't even know what I'm looking at here. The price, though... You know, I, I, I'll be brutally honest with you. If I had more disposable income... I would honestly consider this because this looks like an amazing mouse. You know, it looks like exactly what you might want if you're in, in the type of situation of someone who, who wants a mouse like this. And I would, I'm there. You know, I don't game on my computer. I wish I did. My computer's got awful. Uh, but this makes just doing routine work look so much more easy. What's in the box? Cool. So even here, like, you got, you just have, what is this? Is this, so this is the one. Is this the basic? And then this is the pro. Oh, and it's, it almost looks like you're hiding it. Like, this right here almost looks like you're hiding it. Like, why doesn't it say, Basic 1, Pro 1? Like, ah, uh, just, ah, uh, how we designed the secret luck. And once again, this is just what I'm telling you. You don't want people going here. You don't want people looking at stuff like this. You want to wow them with your video. You can wow them with the price. Honestly, I, I wish, I think this Kickstarter would be better if they just got rid of the basic and just had the pro on here instead of just it feels like you're trying to trick people into buying the basic 100 times to buy let me know what you think in the comments down below maybe i'm just too skeptical because i've done too many kickstart tick kick booster products that all they always they don't always but many of them just have like a a hint of shadiness all around them 100 times debugging persistent pursuit design what is this what the hell is this that does not look like part of the design process here uh, okay, so this looks good. That's cool. Prototype, that's a 3D rendering. Okay. Oh, here we go. This is what I like to see. Pilot production. All right. Oh, wait. Mm. So this is not an impressive picture right here. These two? These ones are. Uh, 
but I've seen other kick booster products or just tech products as well. When they go to the factory and they show the people making the prototypes or the early versions of it, that really, I think, is much more convincing than these, which, I mean, they look like just generic stock photos, to be honest. Like, that section, not a fan. Uh, product idea, product design, first prototype came out two months ago, second prototype, and beta unit shipped and tested. Yeah, so if you have those, why don't you have pictures of those up? Campaign launch, collect orders, start shipping, mass production, and shipping. So this is coming out later this year. So this is a pre-order. Okay. Oh, and here we go. About Deluxe. Looky there. Deluxe. Those look good. Now this. Wait, so why is this buried? Why is this all the way at the freaking bottom? And they don't actually have a shipping section. Okay, so there's not having a shipping section. I guess I can let it slide because you got it all handled in here. But still, it's nice to have. Um... I don't know why you'd bury all this down here. I feel like that's a that's a that's a big misstep because you are or just sending me a link to those. Like just link me to your company website. I don't care if it's in Japanese. If Google will say, "Would you like to translate this?" and I'll say yes, and they'll say, "Oh, cool. This is a real company. Can you do what is answered?" You know, it's just a misstep. So FAQ updates, comments. I'm gonna guess that they are going to be a barren wasteland for the most part. What are the Dimension Deluxe Seekers without palm rest? The Dimension, how long does it take to fully charge it? About two and a half hours to fully charge the mouse. Do you have left-handed version? Sorry, right now. Okay, whatevs. Updates. 100% funded in 10 minutes. And it's a crap update. You can tell that because no one has engaged with it. <laughs> Zero comments. Also, if you think our product is cool, please help by sharing our campaign with your friends or family. Once again, we're so grateful for the support. And even then, that's not cool. Why don't you mention your kick booster? Deluxe World. I'm assuming this is going to be a kick booster. I have I have ran into a couple kick booster products, but act, oddly, they weren't listed on kick booster. But just re let let your if you really want your customers to spread the word, incentivize it. You know, hey, you get 10% off every single thing. I feel like that's a misstep not to mention that. Also, end with a question. End with a question. And here you go, Deluxe team. If you see this. I say this right now to you. I will give you the question for your next update. Because I imagine they're going to be sporadic and they're not going to be very good. Judging by this one. Uh, and that would be, what are you most excited to do with the new mouse on your computer? Or whatever. whatever. That's the basic premise of the question. And you're going to get a whole bunch of people who respond. And it'll kickle those Kickstarter algorithms so you can stay higher on the popularity chart. And so people will be more likely to find your thing. Not that they're going to do it. Kick booster is a way they do things. Uh, check out the comments. Make sure they're not a flaming dumpster fire. Right now, I'm recommending this as a one. Uh, a one? Are there no videos? Mm. It's a tepid one. I, I'm, a, I'm a little bit disappointed that there's no videos. Especially if they had beta units. Like, I just want a video of someone using this. Now that I think about it, there is no gameplay video. On, there's no just no video of anyone using this. Just... Straight up. It's all fancy huts and images. Ooh. Ooh, that scares me. That scares me a good deal. You know what? I'm actually... I'm bumping this to a one, but it's going to be a very, very, very tepid one. And one where I'm going to tell you you're going to take a risk here. I'm going to make a prediction and say this is probably not going to be a good mouse. Judging what I see here, I do not think you're going to be happy with the product you get. Everything about this Kickstarter screams red flags to me. Now, there's nothing major like that i can just point to but it's just like my, my spidey senses are tingling about everything going on in here and i'm gonna give this a one but you need to realize that i, I feel like you're, you're betting on an underdog here i don't think this is going to be a great mouse first i want to thank everybody who commented here to notify about the previous campaign i too have a backer of the failed navi campaign what never received the product and never ever got any response on numerous messages through all different channels i could find this would be the perfect moment for deluxe to admit all that they did wrong i find the behavior of the navi campaign simply criminal deluxe this is your chance to make some good work out of it to go back to your old campaign and actually find out where people who are to got to be your victims and solve every single one i have sent a personal email to a wow and i expect you to get in touch and this is why you should always check the comments before you just back wow Okay, I'm out. You're either purposely misunderstanding or just stuck at understanding written English. I am sorry, but I can't trust someone who apparently misunderstands even the simplest of questions. Perhaps you cannot help, but I don't know, but it's unprofessional. Completely oblivious, blind, or uncaring of what is right in front of your present as far as evidence. Now willing to admit failure, making up more and more excuses. The comments in your past campaigns speak very... Campaigns? Plural? Speak very, very loudly, and I do not care. Okay. 
All right. All right, just want to say some points for new backers in the company to read and answer easily. Deluxe World or Simply Deluxe, please explain the following for backers. The reason of K, uh, starting a new campaign. Let's check out the previous campaign. And this is why I love doing Kickstarter critiques, because we never know where we're going to go. <clears throat> All right, this is the... Ooh, that's a bad look. This is zero. We're at zero. We're at zero. Zero, 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 zero. Do not back this. Uh, oh my gosh, my spidey sense was tingling, and my spidey sense was right! Deluxe Navi, best robot got in the house for long-term comfort. So, let's check. Did it get shipped out? Hmm. This is always a red flag. Anytime. And 104 comments, that means people are pissed. Because I bet you, if we scroll down to back when they were actually running this Kickstarter, they were not getting nearly as much engagement. Let's go check it out. Check it out. I'm calling it. There we go. Two comments. One comment. Four comments. Fifty. Whoa, 51. Holy crap. Good for you. Wow. Did you ask a question here? I bet you asked a question. Leave your comments below and we'll choose the... Yep. You told them to talk. So you've done it before, Deluxe. You know how to do an update section. What the hell are you doing? Oh my god. What? So... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And they had numerous projects, so this did not come out. Now let's check the comments. Two and a half years later, I still haven't received my pledge. Uh, hi, Gary. Uh, now they have created a new account to launch a similar product, and even saying those of us who haven't received our pledges are claiming to not have, they're saying we're the ones who are being dishonest. No, you're not. No, they're not. Yes, sir. Be honest and open. Our team is now working on the old campaign issues now. We welcome you to contact us and follow... Oh my goodness. To be clear, I also object the way you place quotation marks around claiming below as if I and all of the others who haven't received our pledges are on your other account's campaigns or the dishonest one. It should be noted that at no point have you denied ownership of that account or campaign. So that's why you've created this new account. Woo! All right, so now I do have to do another video on this particular product, which obviously is going to get a zero. So no, I do not recommend you check out the Deluxe Seeker Ergonomic Vertical Mouse with OLED screen. But if you do, please click on that Kickstarter link down below uh, because I'll get a small portion of you not receiving a mouse or receiving a mouse that you're probably not going to be happy with. Uh, how many? Oh, two created. So there's two. No, no, no. Let's see how this one goes. Let's dig down this rabbit hole. 1,200 comments. That's not good. Similar thing. Please help us fill out the survey. Oh, no. Okay, so it's not flaming dumpster fire in here. Maybe this one actually turned out well. I've never seen my order. It's not my issue what problems or what have you have faced. You have stolen my money, never answered any of my 17 messages either. I invoke my... Oh, for the people who never received... Just start a lawsuit like I'm going to do right now. Check this. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. This is just going so south so fast and it's so delightful. Supplier scam in China. How to get your money back by K Zhu and Lee. Wait, is that the K Zhu from? No, it's not. Is it? No, it's not. It's not. It's not. It's, it's not them. It's not them. Okay, that's the. Okay. Different person. Uh, but are there, uh, I, I don't even, I don't, I, we don't have time to get into this. We don't have time to get into this. I don't know what's going on here. I never got the product. I never got my product. Uh, is gone and broken. Where is my product? The thing is unusable. If you have a Mac, where is my product? Does anyone have the program? Oh, this is bad. So, oh golly. So there you go. It's zero. Yeah. Dogs, seeker, crap. Don't do it. Don't do it. 838 people. I feel bad for you. But there you go. If you enjoyed what I'm doing, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube. Bye-bye. Oh, it's over here. This is where I gotta click.